Hey folks, this is Bill with Dine Drink Vegas. It is May of 2023. I'm here inside the Bellagio Buffet on a Monday morning. We got here at about 8.30 for breakfast and what I want to do is walk you around the space so you know what to expect. So first let's talk about prices. I paid $48.71 after tax but before tip. Um, and the tip is controversial because I absolutely want to support my servers, however, the drinks are self-serve. I left a tip, as I always do. If it's a, one of the things you should know is that you're going to get your own drinks. Now, that makes it super convenient. When there's something you want, you don't have to wait for something to be available. And the coffee is actually pretty good. And I like those soda machines where you can get whatever you'd like. So even at breakfast, they have a whole lot. And it's prob probably better described as brunch. They have a whole lot of really good, like, main course or salad type items. I enjoyed, for example, some of the slab bacon. That was excellent. They've got a whole lot of bread items. They've got a carving station. And over here, they had some really good mashed potatoes and gravy, some other vegetables like that. I kind of wish I would have tried the bone marrow, but I just wasn't quite that hungry. The dessert station looks amazing. They've got somebody over there scooping ice cream, which seems like that would have been a good choice. Even though it is breakfast time, and I guess they technically call it brunch, but they've got pizza. I didn't have any of the pizza today, but I've had the pizza here before, and the pizza was really very good. A lot of times at breakfast, something like this, right? Just like a meat and cheese plate, maybe with a few vegetables, is pretty good. seafood station so I had some of the dumplings here from the Asian food station that was really very good and I think my favorite thing that I had was probably this Mongolian beef now it is again it's a random Monday in May one of the things which impressed me is when we walked in at 8 20 8 30 there really wasn't a line at all and that helped a lot because we were hungry right there are definitely absolutely times when they have a little bit longer lines so they've got a fresh order egg station there and a lot of these seafood salads are popular there's always shrimp cocktail out they've got some salmon poke they've got what looks to be some tuna so again they have a whole lot of options oh and one last fruit station over there. So seating is in several different areas that look like this. I'm going to take you to one of the unoccupied ones, but it's not a particularly busy time right now. Um, but it's laid out well, so it really, even when they are full, it never feels all that terribly crowded. One of the other things to know is they offer an all-you-can-drink package for $24.99 if you'd like something from the bar, or you can order drinks a la carte. Let's take a look at their menu real quick. And on the other side, it'll tell you what's available with the $24.99 all-you-can-drink package. Do know that the buffet gets significantly more expensive if you're coming in at dinner time or at other peak times. But for breakfast, it's a really good deal. And you're going to be able to easily find something which can make all the members of your group happy. I hope this video has been helpful to you. What we try really hard to do at Dine Drink Vegas is give you short and focused videos to give you the information you need to plan your next trip to Vegas. We never make you watch us eat because nobody wants to do that. And we know we've got faces made for radio, so most of the time we don't show them. But the Bellagio Buffet is absolutely great. It's probably not my very favorite. My very favorites are probably the ones at Wynn and at Caesars Palace. Um, and uh, probably the all-you-can-eat buffet at Palms. But still an excellent choice, particularly if you're here in the Center Strip. Again, I hope this video has been helpful. If it has, we would really appreciate your support for the channel by clicking like and subscribe. You can also look for more videos coming out soon, which talk about our stay here at the Blasio this week. Thanks so much, and happy travels.